I wanted you all to stay around a little up past one because Sarah Baker, the new interim executive director of the Oklahoma Democratic Party, has arrived and she's going to speak to us briefly. But before we uh, conclude this convention stuff, Joe, do you want to say anything about your convention experience? <coughs> Are you sure it was only 20 hours in the car? <laughs> Don't forget the time on buses. Uh, I, think, I think I spent all at least 30, 40 hours in the car. But um, if you ever go to a convention, you should take Elaine Dodd with you. Because once she heard we were going to drive, she suddenly says, Oh, yay! And disappears back into her house. Whereupon she comes out with an entire different wardrobe of more red, white, and blue stuff. <laughs> I would have thought she'd packed it all, but no, she had stuff to bring. And it is like a microphone magnet, because she is dressed out in the red, white, and blue. I have on Hillary stuff. I'm thinking I'm looking pretty. Yeah, no, they want the red, white, and blue lady. And she walks down uh, the convention center, and people are jumping out of the woodwork with a microphone. Saying, oh, what's your opinion? And we didn't, she didn't care what, they, they didn't care what the question was. They just wanted to get the red, white, and blue lady on her. Uh, and I had a different experience. I was the assistant for whip for the Hillary campaign. So it was, it was work. Being a delegate is work. You mm -hmm. have to be in a certain place at a certain time, ready to do something. And, and you want to go sightsee and no, you're going to be at a certain place at a certain time. And, and so if you ever want to go to a national convention as a delegate, realize that Don't if you be want Latino. to